welcome to my channel. I'm Key. In today's video, I'm just gonna walk you through how I uh, do a table setting for Christmas or actually even for New Year's um, using some of the five to six techniques that I typically like to use um, that always give me that finish, um, you know, beautiful tablescape or table setting look. So let's just go ahead and jump straight in. I always start with a textile base. So I'm putting in this cloth table runner that I got from Home Goods. Since the table is really dark, I went with a lighter color table runner to contrast the space. Next, I started on the centerpiece. Since I wanted to keep this simple, I shopped my house and grabbed these faces that I kept from our wedding. I also grabbed some Christmas decor items to display as a centerpiece. I stuck to the practice of grouping in threes by arranging these three items for the centerpiece. I also added in these little decorative berries I got from the Dollar Tree to finish off this simple centerpiece. Next, I wanted to bring in some kind of florals or in this case, greenery. So I decided to drape these stems from the lighting. I got these stems from Target a few years ago. I really like how flexible the stems are and how they bring a festive look to the space. Then I moved on to the plate settings. I actually got these plates from a thrift store. They were part of a set that was priced at $11.99. Thrift stores are a great place to find dineware, especially for the holidays. I found these white plates that I use for my Thanksgiving tablescape at a thrift store. They were $4.69 for all four plates. So I stuck with the basic white napkin here. I definitely should have steamed these napkins to get the wrinkles out, but I'm trying to keep it simple. I'm just folding the napkins to wrap around the plates because I want to go for a look without a napkin ring. I chose to go with gold flatware that I got from Amazon because the gold pairs well with the gray plates and white napkins. I honestly love to use gold flatware all fall and winter. Then I wanted to finish off the play settings with an accent color and some texture. So I went with this berry stem I got from the Dollar Tree a few years ago. I broke the stem into pieces to be placed on each plate. And to complete the place settings, I added in this glassware. Next, I added in some lighting. I got the candles from Target and these black matte candlesticks are from Ikea. They were in a set of three. I love these candlesticks. I use them all throughout my house. And last, I like to add in something seasonal or festive. So I added in this Christmas tree platter that I also found when I went thrifting. And this was the final look. I was going for simple and easy using these six tips I always use for table settings. Thanks so much for watching. If you wanna watch more, you can check out my latest videos here. Please subscribe, like, and share this video. Happy holidays.